These are American sycamores who are raising inside of Highland Hill Farms fenced in area. However, even though it's fenced in, we still have deer damage. Even though there's an eight foot fence all the way around the property, the deer do get in. They can jump an eight foot fence. In places where the fence is not adequate, in other words, where there's a stream or a wet area where there's a little dip in the ground, they'll go under the fence. But they want to rub our trees, and they'll rub your trees too. We can't put deer guards on all our trees because we have so many of them. But that's why we have the fence. But it does help an awful lot. We would have about 50 times the damage that this tree has suffered if we didn't have an 8-foot deer fence. And we also grow a lot of other trees and shrubs like the arborvitaes, which the deer will also eat as well or rub. In the background is an American sycamore. American sycamore is a very old tree. And with that age, there comes a disease that's also very old that targets the sycamore. This disease is called anthracnose. Anthracnose is a fungus similar to anthrax that attacks humans but in a different form. And it's target specific to this tree. It attacks the leaves and can overwinter on the dead leaves and living branches of the tree. So once it's infected, it's very difficult to get rid of. The symptoms of anthracnose is that in the springtime, when the new leaves come out, after they emerge and gain size, they turn a milky white color and fall off. The tree has had this disease for so long that it has evolved a way to survive with the disease. The sycamore is one of the only trees in the world that can photosynthesize through its bark. So when the leaves are all attacked and they all die, it can survive by just having sunlight penetrate hit and XP sunlight hit the bark and it can still photosynthesize. So what happens is the tree loses all of its leaves, it barely eats by and grows a new set of leaves and those new set of leaves usually last throughout the year. You can still expect to lose leaves throughout the year because of the disease, but the tree will not die because of having the disease. How old do you think this tree is? Oh, I, that's an old tree right there. I bet that tree is probably planted when the barn was first made, so probably about 130, 135 years old, I would say. And you grew, you were born on this farm, and it was here when you were born, right? That's right. Okay. Yep. So it's a, it's an old tree, and it is a beauty. It's probably a hundred foot high. Would you say? I believe it is. Yeah. Big so, tree. So it's here at Highland Hill Farm. You come to Route 313 in Fountainville, PA. And we'd be glad to show you this monstrous, beautiful American sycamore tree. Thank. Thank you for visiting Highland Hill Farm in Bucks County, PA.